Good morning, YouTube. It's your man, all the way, George Page, aka the Emperor of Female Bodybuilding, coming to you live, live on YouTube. Now, um, you know, I've been working on some uh, some stuff. I've been a little busy with my bodybuilding content, but I got this interview coming up, and it's with a legend, and it's with one Miss Nancy F. Lewis. And Miss Lewis, I'm a big fan of her back in the day. You know, she was very popular throughout most of good part of the 90s and she you know stuck around to uh, about to the uh, mid 2000s as you know she's a legend you know she had one of the one of those great awesome amazing bodies she's competed at least uh, four Miss Olympias she's competed in also a couple of Miss Internationals and she won back in 22 the uh, overall at the uh, in the Jantana Classic you know Jantana was the uh, one of the few standalone women um, contests like, you know, just a few weeks ago, we, the uh, Rising Phoenix, um, you know, Arizona Pro became an all-women's contest, and this was like the precursor for this. But anyway, um, as you know, I've done a couple of videos about um, Miss Lewis, and recently I did a video where she's um, trying to help out a friend. He's going through some, um, you know, some trying times, and, you know, she did a GoFundMe for him, and I, you know, did a video for it. And I know it's trying times for people financially, especially with the holidays and things going on, but... I still want you to try to donate. So I'm gonna put, um, also what I'm gonna do is like uh, put the GoFundMe um, link in, in, the, uh, in the description. Also she has a PayPal and also her social media um, information. So if you wanna reach out to her, that's cool. I mean, you know, she will really like that. But anyway, um, we were talking back and forth uh, on, um, you know, last night and then she tried to call me back, but I fell asleep. <laughs> I regret that. And um, we've been uh, talking this morning uh, via um, text, and we're gonna, like I said, we're gonna have some. We're gonna talk about her life as a bodybuilder, how she got into the sport, you know, what she's doing now, and also we will talk about her, you know, her um, fundraising for a friend. Like I said, she has an amazing body. I've always been a fan of her physique, and what I liked about her was that she was one of the few women, still in the time in the '90s, where a lot of women were doing it. Who did not build to the wheel of silicone and just oh wow I, I love this picture right here i mean i wish <laughs> whoa yeah i just wish i was that the chick doing it Ooh, wow just a great set of abs just a believable body but morning and like i said uh, i think she was one of those that was just overlooked especially during the time you had linda murray you had laura craver kim chavetsky um sandra Riddell, um, Vicky Gates, you know, those women were just going strong that time, and she was like, you know, you got under the wire from them, but you know, I still follow her. She's my top 10 favorite on bodybuilders, and you know, in all time. But like I said, she'd never been to the wheel of silicone, and you know, she does have tattoos, you know, so one on her arm and one on her belly button, but she never did that. I mean, that's and that's something amazing, especially that idea that you know, back then in those days, you know, you know a lot of promoters and and judges are pushing the idea that you know breasts made you feel more look more feminine, and some women kind of outdo it. And you know, I did a video a while back, uh, live stream where I talked about the pros and cons of breast implants. And she's on the list of one of the uh, few women who do not who have not got breast implants during her time competing. But anyway, she's an amazing person, and um, she's still uh, she's a very attractive woman. You know, being you know at her age and time. But like I said, this is a video. This, this is some live stream. It's gonna be on my Muscle Talk Mondays. It's gonna be two o'clock, and I invite you all to come. I'm you know getting ready to set up the stream your stream yard. So reminder, so we let you know. Um, also, I'm gonna send her some links so she can share with other people so they can come in because it helps grow my channel if I get more people on board. And also, what it does it help get attention to female bodybuilding? They need that attention because they pretty much get swept under by the men. And um, and also people just not comfortable with the idea of women with muscle, but I find her attractive. She may not be attractive by the standards of people today, but she's attracted by my standards. So like I said, two o'clock tomorrow morning, no, I mean, I mean tomorrow afternoon, my Muscle Talk Monday interview with one Miss Nancy F. Lewis. Be there or be square. It's your man, all the way, George Page, A.K.A. the the Emperor of Female Bodybuilding. Like, don't like, don't subscribe, I'm out.